This is News 360 Live on TBP TV and it's brought to you by TBP Professional Institute and Chai Fence. Coming up today, Parliament summons Interior Minister over war killings. Ghana has lost ground in economic transformation. I'm Joanna Bates in the news in detail. The second deputy speaker of Parliament, Andrew Esiamwa Amoako, has summoned the Interior Minister, Harry Kote, to appear before the House on Wednesday, June 26, 2024, to brief lawmakers on the recent killing of private security officers in parts of the country. This follows the killing of two private security men at their duty post in separate attacks at the War East Office of Ghana Education Service and the War Model Junior High School. Member of Parliament for Bolivar Boy, Yusuf Suleimana have expressed concern and frustration over the lack of progress in investigations and the need for more to be done to address the situation. Mr. Suleimana stated, The Minister of Interior last week sent for men and women to Bali to help curb the situation. However, I think that much more is needed to be able to avoid the situation. Within the short period, three people have been killed. And even before that, serial killings were taking different folks. I think this is a very important matter. And I want to draw your attention to it so that the interior minister can come to this house and brief us and give some hope to those areas that are affected. Moving on to other stories. The founder of the African Center for Economic Transformation, Dr. Kinsley Y. Amwako, has stated that Ghana has lost its footing in economic transformation. He made this remark during the Ghana Compass Citizens Convention at the University of Ghana where leaders gathered to discuss a comprehensive vision for the country's political and economic future. The Citizens' Convention is part of the Ghana Compact process, an initiative that seeks to promote a consultative dialogue among all stakeholders to craft a vision for Ghana, a compact for Ghana's political and economic transformation. The primary objective of this convention is to finalize the provisions of a social contract, an agreement between Ghana leaders and its citizens outlining the country's collective aspirations and goals from now on to 2025. And international news. India is likely to face below normal rainfall in June due to the monsoon's slow progress. The country's weather department said on Tuesday, raising concerns for its agricultural sector. Summer rains, critical to economic growth in Asia's third largest economy, usually begin the south around June 1 before spreading nationwide by July 8, allowing farmers to plant rice, cotton, soya beans, and sugarcane. The country is most likely to receive below normal rains or less than 92% of the long period average rainfall, the state-run India Meteorological Department said in a statement. To end the news, a recap of the headline. India to get below normal monsoon rains in June. I'm Joanna Bates. The news was sponsored by TBV Professional Institute and Chai Fence. Stay tuned for more news updates.